something. I feel something. Something lit. My eyes fly open. What's around me? Everything is spinning. I can't even feel my body. Oh, never mind. I can see it. Wait, what? I can feel the sticky humidity, but not as if it's on me. As if it's floating around me. All right, I'm in a forest, but I recognize it. Not as if I've been in it before. Maybe I dreamt it up somewhere? I move forward. Ah! Uh, what was that? I glide, but also as if bouncing? What? I try remembering what's happened previously, but as always, my brain fails me. I feel a, like a weight has been lifted from my chest, from my entire body, actually. I try to think of a trouble, or stress, even a thought I may have once had. Nothing. I try to remember a face. The slate has been wiped clean. Great. I feel a draft. I look down and a gaping hole has been opened right through my chest, where my heart and lungs may have been. But something else also catches my eye. Oh, yeah, that's good. You know, a foot covered in a pink shoe. It's me. I'm laying on the forest floor. I'm matching a hole in my chest. I glide, bounce, whatever the fuck, backwards. In shock, really. A note was pinned to my face. I took out the pin. That's grotesque. Yeah, it uncovers my face. My eyes hold an invisible stare. Tears still wet on my cheeks, but my mouth has been sewn shut. Nice. The note reads, You can long for love, and you can love for a long time, but to long for your love gets you killed. I read the note over and over, Analyzing the creepiness of it, I yelled to the world, Who did this? It's loud to me, but to the world and others, it was just a whisper in the wind. I feel insignificant. I stare at the handwriting. As everything starts to fade into white, I realize that it's my own.